My name is Brian Ashley with BWI Companies out of Carrollton, Texas. We're here today to uh, show you all how to calibrate a spray rig. First thing you need is your spray rig. Second thing, you need a measuring device, a five gallon bucket to catch the water in, and an area that we've got measured off to uh, so, see how long it takes you to time to uh, spray 1,000 square feet. We're going to we're going to go through the process of spraying 1,000 square feet. We'll turn the rig on. Can you do that, Shay? My nice assistant, Shay. Please fire. We need to uh, we need to, you need to time how long it takes you to walk and spray 1,000 square feet. I usually recommend doing that two or four times to give you an average. If you're going to be spraying all day by uh, four o'clock in the afternoon, I think your face is going to be a little bit slower. So maybe do that four times to take an average. gallon 
on number two. six ounces in that last one so two gallons 106 ounces and then you will have to have a calculator so 106 ounces divided by 128 ounces in a gallon is 0.83 gallons so we caught 2.83 gallons of water in a thousand square feet this is a 25 gallon spray rig. So we're gonna take uh, 25 divided by 2.83. 25 divided by 2.83. This sprayer, that's 8,833 square feet in this tank. And that works for, for any size tank you have. If you uh, had a 50 gallon rig, you would just take that 2.83 gallons, divide the 50 by 2.83, and that would tell you how many square feet you're going to spray with that amount of water. And so any chemical that you will put in there, whatever the rate is per thousand, if it's uh, two, two ounces per thousand, you're going to take that rate, two ounces per thousand, and divide it by eight point, or multiply it by 8.3, 8 and that tells you how much chemical to put in that spray rig. Thank you for your time today, uh, BWI, and uh, I appreciate your time watching this video on how to calibrate a spray rig. If we can be of any further assistance, y'all, please feel free to call us.